Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to solve equations with fractions using the multiplication property of equality. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, solve negative 3 over 8, w equals 72. Well, multiplication property of equality states we can multiply one side of the equation by the same number as the other side. So let's go rewrite this, negative 3 eighths, w equals 72. The trick here is finding what number to multiply. Our goal is to get w by itself. So if I multiply the left and right hand side by the reciprocal of the coefficient, negative 3 eighths, a negative 8 thirds, right here to both sides of the equation, what happens? Left side, 8's cancel, 3's cancel, Everything becomes positive, negative times negative is a positive, and we have w by itself. Now, 72 times negative 8 thirds, that's like 72 over 1. 3 goes into 72 24 times, and look at my notes here. A 24 times a negative 8 is a negative 192. I almost forgot that. <laughs> So we have w now by ourself here as a negative 192, but we need to check it. To check it, I rewrite my equation, negative 3 over 8 w equals a 72. I'm going to plug in this negative 192 in for w, negative 3 over 8 times a negative 192 equals a 72. From there, well, we want to simplify. 8 goes into negative 192. Uh, that's going to be, is that 24 times, I think? Yeah, I think it's 24. 24, 1, just double check my notes. Yeah, I think so. <clears throat> 1, 8 goes into negative 192, uh, 24 times. And negative 3 times a 24, uh, it's a negative still, negative 24, is a positive 72. And we can see left and right hand side are equal, confirming that our solution to our equation is a negative 192. Hope you learned something here on how to solve equations with fractions using the multiplication property of equality. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.